Good afternoon. It's a little rainy outside today, but it's a nice afternoon to be inside. And yes, if you saw my thumbnail, I'm going to be showing you my amazing Spider-Man number eight that I found in my collection. But before we get to that, I would like to tell you guys, give me some thumbs up after the video here. Write down some comments. I've been reading the comments and you've been wanting to see more Silver Age and Golden Age comic books, which I do have. So give me some, um, and please subscribe to our channel, JT's Comics and Cards. And we also have our sister channel, JT's Landscaping, which I show you how to operate the mini excavator, the Gravely Brush Hog. My next video is going to be how to show you how to dig up a stump. And that's a, that's a pretty cool video. And um, that's, a, that's a good how-to. So without further ado, and yes, I want to show you that amazing Spider-Man, but I want to show you a few other ones that I got out of my collection and I thought you guys would like to see. This is the Incredible Hulk number 189. It's Hulk versus the Mole Man. That's a pretty good comic book right there. It's pretty neat. That's pretty cool. Got that one here. And then I got another one here, the Marvel on DC. The Uncanny X-Men and the Teen Titans. These are all good collectible comic books. They're going to be worth quite a bit of money someday. They're worth quite a bit now. But that's a nice comic book right there too. That's pretty cool. And I got some older ones, which is Super Spook. That's a nice early 10 cent one. I don't know if you guys ever seen any of these before. That's pretty cool. Super spook. And um, hope you guys are all doing well. I went to a, um, a marketplace today in the town where I live. And there's quite a few comic books there. A lot of graded ones. A lot of not graded. I didn't buy any because I didn't find any that interested me. But there's quite a few. This one is Sergeant Bilko's Private Doberman. That's pretty, it's an old 10 cent one. That's pretty cool. And DC Comics presents Superman and the Green Lantern. Number 26. That's pretty cool. And without further ado, I am going to show you the Amazing Spider-Man number 8 right here. That was in the collection I have. And um, this is for sale. I already have a buyer for it. And the admit, it's about a $3,000 comic book. It has the, what, Fantastic Four, I believe, in it. It's a, it's a nice early Amazing Spider-Man number 8. The back has a little corner tear out of it, which... It's probably a graded five or six. So it's probably a $500 comic book. 1963. So that's a Vision Spider-Man number eight. I got that in my collection and I do have a buyer for this and um, I'm sure he's gonna be happy with it. Um, you don't see too many of these good ones around anymore. And that's that one there. Let's see what I got here. Oh, I got a nice DC special, number five. Joe Kubert. I like that one. That's a nice comic book right there, too. Nice early one. I got many, many more comic books to show you. Um, I got some signed ones. I got right here, right here, and some cards. This is a Star Wars, the Blue Series set one to 66 people are asking like twelve hundred dollars for this now i got all three sets that's pretty cool let's see what else we got here oh here's sherlock holmes number one here's sherlock holmes number one that's pretty cool so I got a few more coming up. I'm on to the, um, like I said, the Rhode Island Comic Con. I'm gonna show you guys 
make a nice video of that place. That convention is pretty cool. And please uh, give me some thumbs up. Write down some comments. I've been reading them. And you guys want to see more of my Silver Age and Golden Age, which I have bringing up. The Amazing Spider-Man number 8. That's a nice comic book right there. And please subscribe to our channels. This one here is JT Comics and Cards. And my other one is JT's Landscaping. Which, like I said, I want to take the mini excavator E35 with a thumb on it. And show you how to dig up a stump. And please hit that notification bell. Thanks. Until next time, have a great day.